Hey guys, Sean here. I'm with Nikon. I've been waiting since yesterday to meet with them. As you guys know, I got here a little late last night and this place was completely ghosted. So I'm happy there's filled with people and they've taken a little bit of time to talk to me about the D4. Now a lot of you Nikon users have asked me about the D4. Well, guess what? I'm going to put it in my hands today, look at it and show you guys just what this thing looks like. And here uh, to speak with me is one of the candidates. Sorry. Nikon's reps. I just came from Canon, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, so I'm here talking with one of the reps and he's gonna explain to me a little bit about the D4 and all its uh, awesome features that it comes with. Well, Gary. <laughs> um, all right, so I got the D4 in my hands and um, it's pretty exciting actually sure. for us. So it's our new flagship camera. Right. It's designed for, you know, of course, photojournalists who, right. who need low light, balanced image quality, high speed performance from yes. the autofocus, yes. you know, sports photographers, wedding right. photographers. It's a marvelous new camera. So it's got an all new 16.2 megapixel uh, FX format CMOS sensor. The ISO range on the camera is, uh, you know, really wide from yeah. 50 ISO all the way up to 204,800. So yeah. any kind of light you want to shoot sure, in, the camera sure. can shoot in. Uh, plus it's got a brand new 91,000 uh, pixel RGB um, 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 color matrix meet sensor that's not only used for metering, right. but in our system, it's also used for what we call the advanced scene recognition system, okay. which means you get improved auto white balance performance, sure. uh, improved ITTL performance, but more importantly, for our photographers shooting sports at high speed, yes. it can focus track using the RGB of the 91,000 RGB uh, sensor. So, right. really, really exciting. Plus, of course, you know I'm going to do this, right? Yeah, you have to. <laughs> I see. I saw your finger on that. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah. please push right. that button. Of course. So it shoots 10 <laughs> frames per second at full resolution with autofocus and auto right. exposure, yeah. or 11 frames per second, yeah. locking the first frame auto exposure and autofocus. Now, video has become a almost a requirement yes, for many, many yeah. photographers, yeah. and a lot of photographers are transitioning to right. not just capturing high quality stills, but also shooting a lot of video. Right. So that's really different. So yeah. we've really loaded D4 with a lot of really great video features that we think that today's photographer, today's pro is going to use. So you got 1080p, yes. full res, you know, full HD on, on the FX sensor. Right. But we've got a couple of tricks. You know, it's Nikon, yeah, so we've got a couple of cool things. Yeah, so yeah. we've got DX cropping yeah. at 1080p. In internal. You yes. Crop. Yeah, and we've nice. got 2.7x cropping yeah. at 1080p, which is incredible. Now, add to that, of course, you can add a stereo microphone. Sure. But now, sound has become just as important as the video content itself. Does this feature so, manual uh, audio settings? It's Well, it features manual audio settings in 20 steps, plus you get VU peak meters and okay. a headphone jack sure. so you can monitor the sound in isolation, really control the sound quality in a big right. way. Now, this is perhaps what, one of the features that's been really grabbing a lot of people's attention. Sure. Through the HDMI port right yeah. here on the side of the camera, you can actually stream uncompressed video out of the camera to uh, uh, an external recorder. So really? really, for those who want to capture the highest quality sure. without the uh, without the internal memory cards, you can do that as well. Yeah. So I know you're ch you're chomping at the bit to put your hands on the camera. So yeah. <laughs> I'm going to pull a little trick on you. You hear me, the mic. All right, I'll hand you let's the camera. do this. Wow, this is amazing. This thing is as big as my head. All right, maybe not as big as my head, but there you go. We got we got to do this right, guys. I'm going to do what I've been wanting to do is hold the shutter button down, and whatever happens after that is not my fault. Oh, that is amazing. I mean, I can feel the power in my hands. So if you guys want to get your hands on this, visit your local camera store. This should be already... No, it'll be available in, uh, in late February. All right, February. We're almost there. So once it comes out, I encourage you guys to go check it out. This D4S is... Sorry, D4, not D4S is really, really taking uh, the photography world by storm. I can't wait to even take this out in the field and shoot with it and show you guys what pictures, the, the, what kind of pictures this produces. So and it's got a 61 point autofocus system. 51 right? point autofocus. 51. You take that, I'll take this. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for the D4. All right, thanks for watching and thank you for taking the time to speak with me and doing such a great job no and holding the mic. No <laughs>